All right, welcome to the Showbox tutorial on how to get the videos off of Showbox to your laptop and to your PlayStation 3. Um, it should work with the PlayStation 4. At least one one of the processes will. I don't know about the other. Now, things you're going to need. Your smartphone, preferably an Android. At least that process I know works. Also, you'll need a thumb drive. Big enough, at least a 5 gig. And a laptop. Now, go into your cell phone. Showbox. Whether it be movies or television shows, for the example, we'll use the television show that I'm already trying to catch up on, Big Bang Theory. See, I already have them downloaded. And I'm just going to play it real quick to show you that I have it on here. Now, there's ways to stream it. But the streaming doesn't work all the time. Let's see, I have the whole episode. Twenty-one minutes. Whoops! I should have showed you the way to stream it. Um, yeah, because you could do screen mirroring, but screen mirroring does not work all the time. Now, if you have a Galaxy S four or five, I think even a three. On the uh, player, it should show you. And you want to use your standard player. iMedia Share also works for streaming. I'll get into that later. Your standard screen mirroring up here at the top of the corner. Hit that, and then you select the device you want it to mirror to. And there we go. Now it's on my smart TV. But again, this doesn't work all the time for some odd reason. I have no clue why. And it's a little slow, and the video quality isn't always the best. Um, I'll give it another second to see if it loads up or not. See, that's what I mean. It's really slow, and it doesn't work all the time. So, to bypass that, use your uh, USB or your charging cable, hook your uh, phone up to your computer. And then once you've done that, you go into your uh, My Files, bring that up, go to the left, and look for your cell phone. Uh, there we go uh, my cell phone has a Pacific name but you can see the Galaxy S5 click on that and now I know the files are already where they're stored because you have the option either card or phone I know mine's on the phone's internal memory bring that up and now you want to look for showbox show box right there and there we go big bang theory big bang theory um, I forget what episodes I've already copied so we'll just go with episode 4 I'm going to copy over into videos and now you can see it's copying And it's done. That simple. Now it's on my laptop and I can watch it on my computer. But we want to watch it on the PlayStation, on the TV. So I plug in my thumb drive. Now for some reason I tried plugging my phone directly into my PlayStation, but that doesn't want to work. So that sucks, but whatever. We find ways around stuff. And you can see the episodes. I am 
going to grab episode 4, transfer that to my video, and it's transferring. Yeah, it takes a second. Next, I'm going to plug my USB stick into the PS3, and it'll look for, my, um, look for my thumb drive, find the file, and then easily copy it over. I'm just showing all the steps just so everybody knows exactly what to do and that it works. I apologize for the video quality. I'm using one of my older uh, cell phones, which I have dozens of, but the camera on this thing sucks. All right, that's done transferring. Now, thumb drive. Uh, it's kind of dark. I'm taking my thumb drive and I'm plugging it in. Let me turn the light on. Ugh. Taking my thumb drive and plugging it into my PS3. Um, there we go, it's reading. Find my remote. Now I go over to videos. And you can see it says uh, USB device. Click on that. And again, takes a second to load. Once you get through the process, it's all quick, simple, and easy. There we go. Big Bang Episodes 2 and 4. Now you want to see that right there. It says Triangle for Options. Bring up Options. You can play it directly from there. But why do that when you could copy it and be able to play it a lot easier? And now it's copying. Now this is how you transfer it using cords and thumb drives. It's kind of complex, not that simple. I know, we want a simpler and easier way to do it. So, a simpler and easier way. One second. Alright, a simple and easier way would be to download iMediaShare iMedia share I already have this set up one second <laughs> all right iMedia share as soon as you launch it you'll see that go into gallery videos look for showbox and there you go you'll have all the videos that you've already downloaded on showbox and you can just click one and then you'll get a list of devices that are available for you to stream to we want to stream it to the PlayStation. Now it's playing, and it's get telling me to go to my PlayStation, use a controller, and look for iMedia. Click on Now Playing, and I'll be able to watch. Using my PlayStation controller, I found the iMedia. It's right there. Click on it. Go to Videos. Now Playing. And it brought me right to it. And there we go. And you can not only stream this way, but you can also bring up the option menu again using triangle. And copy. And as you can see, it is copying. So it's nice, simple, and easy. Again, that's iMedia Share. I'm going to have the name of the app, download links, everything in the description of this video. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoy Showbox. Props to whoever made it. It's an awesome app. Hope they keep updating it with awesome content. As long as we keep showing our support and watching and 
rating, reviewing, all that good stuff. Any questions, leave them in the comments. I'll do my best to answer. People that are watching this from Facebook, you can just hit me up on Facebook. I'll do my best to help. I'm a tech guy. I love tech, love computers, love toys and gadgets. As you can see, I got plenty. <laughs> all right.